The Asus ROG Zephyrus G16 2024 appears to be a robust gaming laptop that is conveniently packaged for portability. However, the precise amount of power that is being discussed is unclear. Also, should you upgrade your laptop to the 2024 model, we should commence this discussion with an unpleasant reality that is difficult to dispute. When purchasing a gaming laptop, compromises are indispensable. One of the biggest compromises to happen usually in scenarios like these is the trade-off between portability and power, as you can absolutely stuff your slim frame laptop with a bunch of high-end hardware, and you'll inevitably have to accept some impact on the overall gaming performance. As a result case in point, the Asus ROG Zephyrus G16 brought out its newest variant and it's impressive to say the least. How impressive and should you consider getting yourself one? Let's find out in our video today. Straight off the bat, let's get one thing straight. The Asus ROG Zephyrus G16 2024 is slim probably the slimmest a gaming laptop can ever get, based on the current hardware limitations, and it's impressive considering the hardware it's packing inside. Straight out of the box, it almost feels unbelievable. At first glance, it balances beauty and brown, as it's beautifully well-built with a mild aluminum chassis that gives it a practical aesthetic, a gritty feel, and a premium outlook, all of which exude quality and a thoughtful design. With this, we can't help but feel like surely this can't have something as an RTX 4090 inside. Can it? Surprise, it does. Now, here's the fun bit. Not only does the Asus R Zephyrus G16 2024 variant manage to slot the most powerful GPU on the planet right now into this minimal frame, albeit with a limited 115 watt TDP, but it also combines the GPU with the top tier version of Intel's new Meteor Lake CPUs. We're talking about the Core Ultra 9 185H with 16 cores and a rated key core turbo boost frequency of 5.1 GHz. Now, if for some weird reason that's not powerful enough for you, you'll also get 32 GB of LPDDR5X7467 RAM 2 TB of storage space, and an ROG Nebula 16-inch OLED display with 240 Hz of refresh rate. And you'll get it all for the substantial price of $3300 neat, right? While it's undoubtedly a huge power level in terms of specs for such a slim machine, we still stand in awe that such abysmal levels of power can be chucked about in a room for a demonstration to confirm your eyes aren't deceiving you. Given the slim chassis and the mere 4.29 pounds of weight the Zephyrus G16 is one of the most portable laptops we've ever seen. It looks like that kind of laptop you could carry around for weeks to use both as a laptop and a portable media machine, and find no reason to complain compared to the behemoths we've been packing earlier just to make do. In regular usage, the G16 should run remarkably quietly and the battery doesn't take that much of a toll, considering the strategically sized 16-inch screen. A helpful addition for power was two separate power bricks that come out of the box one being a full-fat 240-watt unit that delivers maximum performance. Alongside, you'll get a much smaller and lighter 100-watt model that's ideal for travel purposes, which practically cuts down the need to bring in a bulky charger along for the ride, if you don't plan on gaming while being out in Avob. The expansive trackpad is a nice touch as well, and it's bound to feel responsive and smooth in all the right measures. The keyboard though there's not much to talk about except the decent size with a good amount of key travel, but it does appear to be squeezed between two sizable speakers, and we're not sure how we feel about that. Speaking of speakers, the sounds they produce are surprisingly punchy, while not being able to replace a proper set of speakers obviously. As far as laptop speakers go they provide a relatively meaningful bass and mid-range, that's enough to give you a kick underneath your wrists at least. 
With laptop audio not being their magnum opas, this was a pleasant surprise. Fast gaming action is a term that gets thrown around much more than we're comfortable with. But with the Asus ROG Zephyrus G16 2024 variant, it seems to be able to back up its words. Here's a benchmark result from PCGamer.com in order for you to have an idea on what you're dealing with there. They've been running Cyberpunk 2077 on 1080p Ultra settings, and here are the results. As you can see the Zephyrus G16 more than puts up a good show, and manages to come close to, or even beat the 2023 variant of the same laptop. Despite the lower wattage version of the mobile RTX 4090. Additionally, in terms of productivity, the G16 fared reasonably well against the competition kudos to Meteor Lake Core Ultra 9 185H CPU. This is an efficient performer, but unfortunately, it could not stand up to the Intel chip from the previous generation. The Asus ROG Zephyrus G16 2024 is a laptop that comes with too much power for its own good, and while it won't win any competitions where performance is the main concern, it's undoubtedly a quick machine built in an impressively portable package with a solid OLED screen, and that combo has won our hearts. It bound to behave beautifully as the day-to-day -day driver, should feel incredible to use and most importantly comes with a wonderful screen, that'll be a massive advantage for gaming. All of this, while being able to slip inside your backpack without much of an issue, color us impressed. But do keep in mind it's pricey and the 4090 wasn't really something they had to include to bring it into line. Bottom line, the laptop comes with a combination that generates an interesting offer, regardless of the minor bumps here and there, as it's a fairly powerful gaming laptop with excellent features. So, what do you think about this Zephyrus G16? Do you think the rumored price tag is worth it, or are you skeptical, thinking it might not live up to the hype? Let us know in the comments below, and let's get a discussion going. As for everything else, don't forget to hit the bell icon, if you want more content like this on your feed.